Hey guys, I'm Murphy from Huidu Technology. This video shows how the new HD SAS process works. This is a synchronous all-in-one machine. After connecting the corresponding network port, we can start debugging by connecting the USB debugging line to the communication. The module is full color P2.5. The chip is ICN2163 and the decoding is 5958. The whole screen is 13 modules wide and 16 modules high. Each receiving card takes 1 wide and 8 high. Click on HD set. We see that the synchronous card and the asynchronous card are distributed on the left and right sides. And the device information will be displayed below. First, select the device. Click the new process in the lower right corner and click the display configuration interface to debug after confirmation. In the sending card per red meters, click to check whether the number of receiving cards is correct. Then click on the receiving card per red meter interface to adjust the box information. After checking the hub settings, enter the smart settings. The first step, select the corresponding chip IC decode and confirm scans of the module. The second step, select the corresponding color according to the status of the module. The third step, observe the phenomenon of the module, fill in the corresponding value. This step is to determine the row height controlled by a pool of RGB data. The fourth step, observe the phenomenon of the module and fill in the corresponding value. This step is to determine this scanning type. The last step is to observe the phenomenon of the module and click the corresponding value according to the position of the bright spot. Until all the bright spots on the screen are clicked again. Then scan settings can be completed. After tracing points are finished, click Preserve Connection, then click Send and Query. Finally, enter the Connection Setting interface to connect the receiving card. Generally, a box is carried by a receiving card. We set the width and height of the receiving card according to the actual width and height of the receiving card connected to the LED screen. To set the connection mode of the receiving card, select a network port and then a connection mode of the receiving card. And then pull to the left of the corresponding box to select the connection mode of the other network ports. Then click send to complete the screen configuration. That's all for today's sharing. If you want to know more about other functions, please let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching.